The National Museum of Australia has taken the wraps off a new permanent exhibition that tells Australian history through Indigenous eyes. At a time when there's renewed focus on Indigenous rights, the Talking Black to History exhibition couldn't come at a more appropriate time. And a warning, Dan Borsch's report contains images of Indigenous Australians who have died. Australian history didn't start in 1788 and Aboriginal history didn't finish in 1788. How to tell the story of Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islanders' ancient connection to this land alongside more contemporary stories underpins a new permanent exhibition at the National Museum. Talking Black to History is a way of reclaiming our experiences in the story, story of, of Australian history and we're, we're doing it in our own voice. And that reclamation begins at the front door with this commanding work, Yumari, by late Papunya artist Uta Uta Jungala, which sets the foundation. How it was, our connection to people, place, dreaming, um, and the kind of continuity and connectivity between those things. And then as time passed and the colonising process persisted, the unravelling started. And on one side of it, you've got um, Michael Cook, an Aboriginal photographer who has, in fact, done a role reversal and Cook Landing happens to be black people and the whites on the shore. So it's sort of reclaiming history. On the other side, the Mistake Creek Massacre in, um, in the East Kimberley, 1915, by Queenie Mackenzie. So it's some serious truth-telling. That truth-telling underpins the entire collection. A photo and gown connected to John Moriarty, a member of the Stolen Generation, to items relating to numerous protests for land rights, representation, recognition and to be heard. A dialysis chair from the Purple House Renal Service in Central Australia and a space that's yet to be completed with a confronting artwork of an Aboriginal death in custody from 1985, perhaps a metaphor for ongoing calls for justice. With a mix of traditional and contemporary storytelling, just what does curator Margot Neal want visitors to take away from the collection? A truer understanding of Australian history. An understanding of which may well reinvigorate a discussion about all history and what it says about the future. Dan Borsha, ABC News, Canberra.